Good morning and welcome to WJZ.com. A little sliver of a sunrise, a little cloud deck. Clouds will be disappearing as we move through the day, slowly but surely. We'll end up with a fairly okay, if not kind of sunny, afternoon. Let's go ahead and take a look at temps. That, 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 those clouds gave us quite a blanket effect. Overnight temperatures remaining, in many cases, 10 plus degrees above normal. Now, down to the south, we have a pretty vigorous area of low pressure. It's, it's passing by to our south, almost directly east, but future cast will show some clouds trying to spill our way about 9, 30, 10, 11 o'clock as uh, that storm does meander offshore. But tomorrow, between high pressure coming out of Omaha and that area of low pressure, a pressure gradient is going to set up and the wind is really going to get intense. Blustery tomorrow and very windy on Friday. Then we got to start looking at this area of low pressure out over the, uh, the uh, near Midwest. I want to take a closer look at this with a different future cast. It's going to be very mature as it moves across the Mississippi River up toward the Great Lakes, already dragging a tremendous amount of moisture a tremendous distance. Look, that low is going to be basically right over Chicago. It's pulling moisture up from the Gulf of Mexico. And the time stamp shows 155 on Sunday, a, a snow mixed precip line right over Baltimore. So that's something we're going to have to keep our eye on as we move through the week's end. And weekend. 44 today. Overnight tonight, rather cloudy, but calm. 30s your low. 37, windy, I mean, blustery tomorrow. Then windy, look at that, blustery to windy, from bad to worse, tremendous. 37, 34 Friday. Saturday was sun, 35 degrees. Um, 37 on Sunday, but there's that chance, some afternoon mixed precip lasting into Monday. That overnight low of 29 looms ominous Sunday night. Something we'll watch. Tuesday, 41, some sun returns, maybe after some morning flurries. Y'all be safe. Just wear the damn mask. And thanks so much for stopping by. WJZ.com.